Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the semi-finals between Extreme and Team Infamous. It's the second map. Extreme has actually won the first map on Cash, which was actually Team Infamous's map pick. So this is going to be their own map pick. I think this is going to be the knife round, actually. Yeah, it's going to be the knife round. Whoever wins this knife round will be switching sides to CT, I'm sure. Not many teams actually choose the T side on overpass. It tends to be more CT sided. So I believe it's going to be. Um, can't really cast a knife around. Yeah, it's going to be Team Infamous. Okay, so I believe that Team Infamous is actually going to choose the CT side. I apologize. I had my mic muted the whole time. Really? Yes. Was I talking over you the entire time? So, uh, what? Well, no, actually, it was perfectly synced. Believe it or not. Really? <laughs> yeah. But okay. thank God I did not miss much. At least, no, uh, yeah, just a knife round. Infamous, as you said, choose to start on the CT side. No surprises there. It's overpass after all. Here's Mandy 2k from Barrels, that lands that headshot, Jojo backs him up as well, that's Mayhem going down, but KRC responds, finds that headshot onto Mandy 2k, they can make their way onto that B site now, but they still can't push up, there's a lot of CTs here, there's already rotation coming out as well, but Nasty lands that kill onto Patola, here's Airhead from Heaven, down to a 3v3 by the way, Extreme 5, they have enough time to just back off and go to A if they feel like it, but now it's way too late, Jojo gets one, here's Nasty on the site getting Jojo and Sporky as well. It's down to a 1v2 with Airhead super low, down to 5 HP from heaven. They know exactly where he is as well. This is nightmare stuff for Infamous and Nasty lands that shot. Okay. Airhead goes down. Yeah, and already a terrible start for Infamous. They, they made it work. For the most part, but uh, nasty though, got that 4K, and that's basically what halted Infamous' ability to actually win that round. If 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 nasty didn't perform that well on that pistol round, that would have easily went to Infamous's side. And now that they've actually lost the pistol round, Extreme is already on a an advantage considering this is their T side overpass. So if they can actually win this force by, they should be able to win the eco. So which will already give them a three-round advantage on their T-side, which is uh, would be a perfect start for them. It Infamous, would on the other be, hand... Would be a dream come true. They're very focused on B, though. They're going to go towards A. This could be it for a 2 5 here. They've got an AK as well. Here's Wimp with the MAC-10. Doesn't even need an AK. Finds that kill onto Patola. Mr. Nice finds the second entry onto Jojo. They smoke off Dumpster as well. This is perfect for Extreme 5. The bomb is taking away Infamous. Running out of time and out of options here. They either rush through that smoke, or they give up the round. And right now, I just heard a molly being thrown into a smoke. That happens. No problem there, but Extreme 5, still all five members are up and alive. Here's KRC jumping down. Bit of an aggressive play, but it pays off. He finds that kill onto Sporky. Last two members all go into hiding. Airhead with a 5-7 at short, and Manny 2 k choose, chooses to save his or her armor and helmet, and is sees it as well. Actually gets a kill onto KC, and picks up a MAC-10 as well. This is perfect for Mandy. Oh, Mandy. <laughs> gets two kills. That's, aye, aye, aye. <laughs> that's the only kills of a round, too. That, that would have been uh, a clean sweep otherwise. But, uh, yeah, and I'm quite sure it's a he, so I'm quite sure it's no she's here. Are you sure, though? Because you never know. Yeah, you never know. I you guess, never know, dude. I guess if you're watching the stream, you can see their faces. That's uh, the, uh, So I'm sure the streamers know, at least. Ah, uh, yeah, we, we can't see the players' faces, by the way, guys. So you tell us if Mandy is a grill. <laughs> yeah, I highly doubt it. But... So, <laughs> Until we find out, uh, all we do know for now is that Extreme is leading, and they have almost clean sweeped. 
So because of that almost clean sweep, they're going to have the ability to farm some money here with those submachine guns. And yes, I uh, I'm watching the stream now, and yes, Mandy is definitely male. Unfortunate. <laughs> I mean, you For still you, never man. know. <laughs> she could be hiding. It could all be a disguise. You never know. But okay. extreme five are pushing towards that A side, and they make it work. KRC finds two kills. Wimp shoots Airhead in the face as well. There's only two people left. It's Jojo and Sporky. Never mind. It's just Jojo left. Alone versus four, with nothing but a 5.7 and chest armor, he's about to drop as well. Money. KRC picks up three with a Mac 10. Yeah, lots of lots of money, and because of that, he does make 8k. So he does throw away that Mac 10. I wouldn't throw it away. I mean, Mac 10s are still pretty good, but and I not, understand not, why, yeah. because. Yeah. Although it is a pretty good weapon, still can get uh, decent kills against M4s with it. But he does not want to weaken his uh, offense with the rest of his teammates. They're all using AKs, so they want to maximize that damage output. So that would be a very good buy from him. But let's see, they're already pushing B. That's a that good boost. spray from Nasty. He finds that kill onto Jojo. Here's Extreme 5. This is their chance to run away with this game. Or not, Mandy 2k finds that kill onto Nasty, but Wimp trades it back. The bomb is ticking away now, hiding inside the smoke. Infamous, they've got three people to go for this retake. Here's Airhead up in heaven with that op. There is a smoke for Mr. Mayhem, so he can smoke off heaven if he feels like it, but for now, he doesn't really feel like it. Sporky is in water. Patola is close to short. Sporky finds that headshot onto Wimp. KRC trades it back, here's Patola! They almost lined up for him, but he did not have enough damage to get both. Time is running out, Airhead had to jump down into the water, but now he realizes it's way too late. He just goes straight to his death. Takes KRC with him at least, but Extreme yeah. 5 win the gun round and lead 4-0. to 4-0 to zero already, and they're gonna be forced on another eco. So... <clears throat> Potentially 5-0 here. I'm going to, I see potentially for one reason and one reason. Uh, both of these teams have won a full eco in the previous map on cash. This is a completely different beast as it is overpass, but I know that both of these teams are capable of full ecoing each other, so I'm just going to say potentially. But it's a really, really high probability that they are going to win this round. So it should be a 5-0 here, which is a very good lead on the T side of overpass. A perfect lead, actually. Only Sporky with armor as well. But look at this flank here, he knows it too. Mr. Nice, he knew, he knew one of them was gonna get impatient and go for the flank, and it was Jojo. Mandy 2k, gets a kill with a P2000 onto Nasty, but here's Whip and Mayhem, shutting the rest of Infamous down. Extreme 5, they only lose one member, and they lead 5-0. Nice B-hop there. And now they again bring back that op that they uh, so need on the overpass, which is a very good weapon to have, especially if you're holding from heaven towards B or looking towards um, multiple places on A, actually. Many people tend to go mid with it. Well, others tend to go long with it. So different places they can go. And it looks like they are going to go towards mid. Quite a few big push here on mid as well. Yeah, unfortunate Molly there, but Airhead, this is a good start for Infamous. The op gets a pick, and he falls back. That's his favorite move, really. He's done it a few times this series. Yep. Moves forward, gets a pick, and falls back, and it's worked. And it rotates to B as well. Oh, Mandy almost got caught there. Bit of, bit of, bit of luck there to survive that. CSGO is like 80% skill, 20% luck. Maybe, maybe a bit more luck. Sometimes more luck, yeah. yeah. Depends. I've seen people flying around getting headshots when they're not supposed to. I don't know if yeah. you know the famous simple uh, no scope says he was jumping down yes. on cash on B. Yes. Where he gets no scope, one no scope while flying down, and the other one like uh, jumping down from away. heaven. Yeah. Uh, I mean, the second one was skill, but the first one was just luck. 
Come but on. it was a no scope, so there was a lot of luck to it because you can never really uh, predict where a no scope's gonna go, just because of the fact that it's being a no scope. So I'd say in that case it was like forty percent luck and sixty percent skill because he what he did have to aim it towards the enemy. At least, yeah, he had to move yeah. his mouse a bit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But well, not looks good. Five. This is their chance to win this round, and Wimp finds Patola. He's down to eight HP though. 15 seconds left on the clock, but the bomb should be planted in time. Nasty finds Mandy, Mandy 2k as well, but nice Jojo flank. responds at last. It's a flank from behind as he makes his way from toilets. But the other two team members from Infamous, here's Airheaded Dumpster with the op. Looks like Extreme 5 decide to hold it from long. The defuse is coming through from Sporky, however, did they not hear this? Do they not realize this? They Ooh. shoot him in time though. Mr. Mr. Nice. nice. Saves the round for Extreme 5 there. K KRC <laughs> was actually flanking, and you, if you didn't notice the bullet holes that you're seeing in front of the CT, basically he was missing every bullet from the back there. So <laughs> Mr. Nice, uh, they were kind of lucky that Mr. Nice... The savior. Got, yeah, he got those two original kills before killing the bomb uh, diffuser. So that could have been ugly for them, but... um. Most importantly, if you didn't notice in that round, after the AWPer, Airhead, got a kill and he went back towards B, uh, they pushed towards A, and then he smoked out every single, um, like, every, sing every single area that Airhead could actually try to peek in as an AWPer. So as he was a, as, as an AWPer, he couldn't just push forward. He had to hold a certain angle. And because of that... He was basically knocked out of that retake from the get-go. So they used their utility correctly to actually minimize the risk of getting basically taken out by that AWP. And that was a very important round. And now that they only have AKs, they don't need that AWP as long as they're pushing with their utility like that. And you don't need it on Terrace as much as you need it on CT, the AWP that is. Oh, nice push. Oh, two kills already. This is turning ugly already. This is another eco that they might potentially lose. Where's that bomb plant? Look at the bomb plant. I the would bomb get very dropping. worried now if I were Extreme 5. They've lost a round very similar to this one on cash. And right now it's looking that they might lose this one too. There's Jojo from Connector protecting the bomb. But Mayhem and Mr. Nice Good both nothing. get kills. They've Turn things down to a 2v2, but still, they're very low on HP here. They don't have much to work with. If they had made that boost here, the CTs could have actually done something, but no boost means Mr. Nice can pick up the bomb, but there's someone right behind him. That's Patola pushing through the smoke connector. Airhead makes his way to the A site, hiding in truck, and he might just catch oh. one of the T's off card here. All he needs is one deagle shot on Mayhem or one on Nice. Here's Patola. Finds that kill on Nice, but Mayhem trades it back. It's a 1v1 oh, now. Mayhem with 19 HP. This is his, his chance to make the play here. With that knife. No, no play. <laughs> Just completely denied. Yeah, that knife. Should have let, at least kept something out. Yeah. You should have expected that the other guy was going to be near. So, I don't know. Took the risk there. And they did lose another eco. So, they have a lot of money for the sake of the fact that they've won six rounds in a row. But in the issue here is that Infamous have won a round on an eco, so they can easily buy. Not to mention Airhead does not have to buy himself because he has an AK. But one major issue now is that Infamous has lost that loss bonus. So if Extreme wins this round, again, Infamous is going to be forced on a, probably another eco. So. They need this round to continue that oh, Nice push, but bad miss from Patola. That was an easy frag he should have gotten. Yeah, yeah. And uh, would that come to hunt them? Was not good. Infamous, they're losing. This is not good for them at all. Their economy is not gonna survive this. They need this round, but Extreme 5 are not making it easy. Patola missed Too that off misses. shot. He's in trouble now, he's getting burned alive oh. as well. 
Mayhem picks it up with a beautiful headshot, really. Jojo responds, however, could he be the savior? No. no. No saving for you, and Infamous <clears throat> lose the round. Extreme 5, lead 7-1. to one. Yeah, when they want that loss bonus, and the only one that has money is Airhead because he got an AK on that eco. So, he has the money, but he's the only one that has the money. So, he's just gonna drop a few pistols here, realistically. Yep. And he's actually going to buy armor and stuff just to balance his economy. And I mean, that wasn't really needed. This is pretty much a full eco. You don't have to, uh, you know, throw away all your money. Because if you just die, you you lost it for no reason. I mean, yeah. save it and maybe buy an op next round. You know, this is a better idea, especially when you don't have that loss bonus. At least try to save it for an op. Now he just lowers his money quite significantly over an eco. So, let's see. I mean, is they've nice won though? it before. They've yeah, won equals true. before, so... I mean... But you can't depend on that. No, you cannot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's the risk. There's Extreme 5 make their way onto the side. Sporky does land a headshot onto Wimp. Nasty can't seem to land anything there with a Mac 10. Finally finds that kill onto Patola. Took him a while, though, but his teammates make up for it. They both get kills. Which means Jojo and Airhead are the last two remaining for Team Infamous here. In a 2v3 situation. Seems like they're gonna go for this, surprisingly enough. Here's Jojo flashing long. Doesn't really hit anyone with that flash. Flash. Not really what he was hoping for. KRC. He was scoped in! Oh, wow! Qu uh, nice quick scope from KRC to get that kill onto Jojo Airhead. Finds that one D, but it's not enough. KRC is ready with the op. Said double kill for him in Extreme 5. They've built up a huge lead now. 8 to 1. This is very unlike the infamous that we saw on map one. Yeah, but this is I, the, my look of doubt is that I sort of expected this in a way because infamous were really dropping at the end of that second half. And at the same time, this is extremes map pick. So I felt like infamous was one of their, their strengths was that it was their own map pick. So they were most comfortable on that map. But now that it's on the extremes map pick, they're, they're showing a bit of reluctance here. Oh, that Molly missed. I was wondering why he didn't move. Nice and nasty. Get the entry frags. I just realized that their names are antonyms. It took me a while. <laughs> Mr. Ooh. Nice and Mr. Nasty. Yeah. Took me only uh, one game and nine rounds to notice. Yeah, but, but Nasty doesn't call himself Mr. though. Yeah, that's the... He ruined it. He ruined yeah. it. Mayhem, though, still has that Mr. on him. Well, for now, Extreme 5, they are in complete control of this round. The infamous Noldis, gonna save their weaponry. But Extreme 5, they're really running away with this now. 9-1. Bear in mind, it was Extreme 5 who won map 1. It was a lot closer than this. But they won yeah. map 1, and if they win it here... They'll win the series 2-0 and qualify to the final. So, infamous. They've got to come up with something. There was a potential 16-13 as well on on cash. It ended up 16-11 because they lost that gun round. But if they did win that gun round, infamous, it could have been a 15-13. So, um, they could have easily made that an overtime. Yeah. So that was that, that was much closer than it showed. Well, this this game is very different. Definitely not close to any overtimes. If anything, it's closer to a 16-0 than it is as close to an overtime. So, only that one round, and that one round, if anything, actually bit them in the end because Infamous, that one round just allowed them to lose their loss bonus, which allowed them to eco a lot more often. So, although winning rounds are important, uh, your economy is also important. So, unless they can win multiple rounds in a row, then there's no point winning just one round and then, you know, losing the rest. It's just you're you're breaking your own economy. So yeah. what most importantly is try to get a string of rounds. If you can get three, four rounds in a row, at least two. If you can get three, then you can at least buy if you lose. You know, that's the more important thing. Anyway, it is a 2v3 here, actually. 
This is good stuff for Infamous if they can finish off this round, but KRC will be allowed to plant the bomb. Still, Airhead finds that kill onto Mayhem, which means KRC is all alone versus three. He does not spot the player along because <laughs> Panic, he's playing bro. on 4 3 aspect ratio. That's mm. what you get, really. Why is Green Master Race? Well, I use 4 by 3 as well, but uh, it's preference. Like, I switch around sometimes. Uh, not that long ago, I was actually on 19 20 times 1080, like the uh, HD. Yeah. That's that's like, my that's my resolution, and I yeah, uh, I really graphics, like it honestly. I graphics like. are pretty nice. Yeah, one casting I do is 1920. I do actually full screen window just so I can uh, have my uh, two screens up. But like, I don't know. I think it was more like he panicked. If you notice from his mouse, he wasn't sure where that shot was coming from. He started his mouse started to shake, and yeah, yeah. knees weak, arms are heavy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's probably <laughs> spaghetti all over his keyboard already. Yeah, but he does, they do still have the money, so... It's... Yeah. You're not throwing a smoke here though, okay, now they do. Oh, there's the smoke, a bit late, but oh. doesn't matter, gets the job done. Mr. Nice and Wimp get the entries, as they always do, it seems like. He's like infamous are just fall apart whenever Extreme 5 decide on a site. Plant the bomb, man. KRC okay. can't seem to press E. <laughs> Finally manages to get it done. I know it's hard, but he plants the bomb. In a 5v3 situation, extreme vibe, they are in complete control here. Just have to hold on for 35 more seconds, and they will have this round in the bag. They've already won the half. Yeah. Everything now is just bonus. Do you actually hold E when you plant the bomb? You can if you want to, yeah. Yeah, I mean, do you? Usually, no, but when it does that bug where it cancels the plant, I switch instead of left click to E. Oh, it's okay. just faster. Well, I think it's more like he wasn't sure if he was actually planting, and then by the time he actually lets go, it already starts planting. It's a bit of a mistiming. Yeah. Thank God the round ended before the nade hit. <laughs> the nade was gonna kill him, I think. The guy nearer, I think, not the AWP. Yeah, yeah, the other arm. guy, he was pretty yeah. low. But that nade, oh man, he got a bit lucky there. Well, they do have money, so I don't think they're going to be too disappointed by it. There's only a few rounds left. Yeah. But uh, Infamous, now that they have all the lost bonus they need, they have all the weaponry they need, but are they going to make this work? They only have two people on B here. Oh, good molly. Tola finds win. But Mayhem responds. Finally, Ooh. Team Infamous, they stop that push. KRC is super late with his op. Yeah. There's not much. He's afraid of that Molly. 1v4 situation for KRC. He's about to get flanked very soon as well. He's ahead and lands the shot. That's JoJo dropping. There was a flash as well. He's starting to panic. And just like last time, Mandy2k is the one who shut down KRC. Even. Bit of a BM there, standing watching his body there. That's a bit of a BM, Mandy, my friend. Not something you're allowed to do when you're seven rounds behind. Well, he didn't teabag it. We... He didn't teabag it. The teabag would have been too much. Yeah, especially if they lose this next round. <laughs> <laughs> but then finally they're getting rounds on the board, and Extreme actually... We won't have that much money next round. They will should be able to buy, but they won't be the best of buys. So, chance for Infamous actually to start making rounds here. That miss though, what was that miss? KRC. This is very unlike him. No, no, not KRC. There's an opera watching him. He was looking the wrong way, and I think it was Airhead, and Airhead missed it. Both of them missed. Oh, he does not yeah. spot the player towards his left behind the tree. Yeah. This could be deadly for KRC, and yes, it is. Mandy 2K finds that headshot. Can he get another one? Yes, he can. Mayhem also dropping to the powers of Mandy 2K, but Nasty finally shuts him down. Took him a while. The camera's but not they changing managed to me. get the kill in the end. Oh, that's the, the good old auto director bug. Just switch to another player and then switch back to auto director. Oh, okay. Yeah. Still. Have we been running an auto director this entire time? Yeah. I thought we, there, was a, <laughs> there was an observer there. Okay, I guess not. I think the observer is having internet issues. Patola finds that kill onto Nasty. And so Infamous have a two man advantage. With 40 seconds left on the clock, Extreme 5, they have to think of something here. 
and they're thinking of long, it seems like. It's a smart smoke from the CT, however, to buy some time. And it's buying precious seconds here for Infamous. Not much time left on the clock. Nice and wimp. They have to think of something. They have to think of something fast. 25 seconds left on the clock. Jojo finds wimp. Which means nice. is the last man versus four. If they're smart about this, they're going to wait for time to run out. Before killing him. That would be optimal. Heading into the final round of the first half. Yeah. He's gonna save, I believe. Yeah, he's gonna save. He's not gonna peek. He must look have at that. Someone's pushing up. Irad's pushing up. He does he not spot him? A lot of people think the best aimer should be entry. That's kind of wrong. Actually, the best aimer should kind of be the uh, secondary. should be the secondary. Yeah. Because um, for the for a lot of the time, because of positioning from the CTs, the entry can many times die to a good position from the CTs, especially if he's going in flashed. And the second, the second guy is basically the guy who's supposed to be trading. And many times you'll notice the secondary get two or three kills in a row after that entry dies. So, yeah, there's many cases where the best aim should actually be second. Anyway, we are starting finally. And the starts things off with that shot on the Mandy, but Airhead responds with an upshot of his own. The momentum was completely broken here, so both teams are coming into this round with a bit of a fresh mindset, a fresh mentality. Extreme Fiver taking things a bit slower this round, a bit slower than usual. Yeah, I think they they just really want that last round and I think they just want to split up Infamous's defense a bit, but they are very aggressive on B. So this is going to be a bit risky here. He doesn't Ooh. notice him either, so Jojo gets another free kill. So now it's just going to be a 3v4 and this is going to be an advantage for Infamous. Yeah, as you said, they really, really want this round. 5-10 is much, much better than 11-4, naturally. But it gives them some breathing room to work with for the second half. An Extreme 5. They wouldn't mind a 10-5. They'd, they'd love an 11-4, but 10-5 is something to be proud of on T-side overpass. As the bomb slowly makes its way towards B, there's 30 seconds left on the clock, so they have to commit now. It's now or never, really, for Extreme 5. They've got two smokes, two flashes as well to work with. As Nasty and Wimp make their way from Monster. They're not making any noise. And Nice was hoping to bait some people into rotating from Extreme 5. And right now, there's no one looking Monster. Here's Wimp behind the pillar. Sporky has to fall back. He's just at the edge of the smoke. And Wimp finds that headshot. He wants to smoke Heaven as well. But Jojo finds that kill. Nasty trades it back. However, it's down to a 2v2. Heaven is smoked off. It's a nade thrown there from heaven, but not enough to take the kill. He's nasty. Can you land that final shot? Yes, he can. But Tola goes down. Mr. Nice. I believe he's the seed once more. But for now, it is a 1v1 between Airhead and Nasty. Airhead switches oh, to an bad. AK. Trying to get nasty there, hoping to get lucky, but no such luck. And Mr. Nice was. <laughs> he timed out. Lagging in the middle there. Airhead's nowhere. There's no way he's gonna get this defuse. Yeah. Yeah. I believe <laughs> there is no way that uh, Mr. Nice would have allowed that to. He would definitely complained if they lost that round due to him timing out to a wall. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, it looked funny. <laughs> you know, for these players to have these pauses just so they could fix the issue, so they could play fairly with 5 ping, with over 120 FPS and all that. That That is that is proper administration and that's proper um, fairness to the players especially. Yeah. So anyway, that uh, we are going live. So finally we get to see... Thank God. Yeah. <laughs> Do I hear we're, that? We're... Uh, about to head into the second half now. As a reminder, in case you guys have forgotten, this is game two of the best of three Extreme 5 friendly lead in the series 1 0. There's Patola, however, getting that entry frag onto Nasty. But look at that KRC from Connector. Finds the headshot onto Sporky. Mandy 2K goes in. He gets two. Oh my god, that's KRC and Mayhem dropping. Wimp, last man standing. How is Mandy 2K doing this? Oh, he's stuck in the door. Oh, that's painful. That is very, very painful. He got stuck in the door. It was painful for his head as well. 
Yeah, Patola picks up the bomb and plants it. Okay, okay. That should not have happened. He does not have a kit. He does not have a kit. Yeah, no kit and very little time to work with here. Airhead's down to 40 HP, but Wimp is also quite low. Misses that shot. Can he land it? Yes, he can. Does he have time? Finds that kill on the airhead. The question is, does he have time? It's going to be very close. Actually, be very close. he has it. He has it. Yeah, yeah he, he definitely has it. has it. He has it. He has it. He has it. Well played, Wimp. It's a 4K for him in the pistol. He clutches it for extreme. Only just, but he clutches it. And a throwaway from Infamous. And that's, honestly, that was the pistol round they needed. This is how... We do it? No. <laughs> <laughs> this is how uh, strong they were throughout this game. It's, it's, it's weird that Infamous... This is one hell of an underperformance if you compare it to Map 1. This is not the Infamous that we saw on Cash. No. Maybe they just had nothing prepared for Overpass, which is... Odd, honestly, considering how popular this map is. Already a scout shot as well. Yeah, that's KRC finding that kill with the scout on a non armor target. It's a kill, alright. Patola goes down to 7 HP in toilets. KRC missed that scout shot this time, but here's Mayhem from behind. Gets both Patola and JoJo. Airhead gets something with the Deagle. But it's not enough, Nasty and Mayhem pick up those final two kills. As you said, it's a throw away, a throw away round from Infamous, but now they've got to make it count. They have to make it count, not just because it's their going round, but they need to close that gap a bit. The gap has grown a bit too stretched out, I would say. And they need... Nine rounds, I think? Yeah, they need nine rounds just to make this comeback. They are going to throw those smokes. It looks like the um, Extreme is actually going to go for an aggressive push down mid. And there's no one there. They might actually flank them. This is so bad here for Infamous. They could easily flank them here. But they are going back instead. They still continuing the where they could have actually flanked them. They're going back. So now, Infamous acts as a potential to take over B. Without well, the possibility of flank. Not, not with that flash. Not with that flash. Your head, my friend. With that headshot, though. Oh, yeah. It's definitely with that headshot. If Patola can produce another one, but Nasty shuts him down. Here's Airhead, however, with the AK. Can he land something? Yes, he can. And Nasty drops at last. Wimp responds with a kill onto Sporky. Here's Airhead again getting Wimp. Which means Mayhem is the last man standing for Extreme 5. Alone versus 3. Smart Molly onto the site, but the bomb's already been planted. He's got nothing but a FAMAS in a dream. And Mandy2K crushes that dream infamous. Win the round they needed badly. They need something badly, and at this point, they have no money, so they're just going to save this round. I think they're actually going to buy a few pistols. Mayhem can actually drop a few pistols if you wanted to, but I don't think he's actually going to go for it. Instead, he's going to buy himself armor. Selfish, selfish, man. No, but uh, he, he actually can make this work. And he can actually buy an AWP next round. This is going to be good for them. Now, this is just going to be mostly a throwaway, especially that knife out. Not the best start. Wimp gets that deagle kill, but Jojo responds. Here's Mayhem with a CZ. He gets nothing. Jojo finds that headshot nasty with his CZ. This time he gets the kill. And Jojo goes down, but still, Mr. Nice, he's up with a P250. Gets one. Brings it to a 1v2, but Airhead shuts him down. And Infamous win the round, but they lose three members in the process. <clears throat> Ooh. Yep, so now Mayhem can go for that up with um, Glass Cannon, but so can Wimp, so let's see if they're actually just going to half buy here. A bit of a big half buy from Nasty, especially. I understand the rest of them, but he's all the way down to 1.6. That's a lot of money lost. But they do have armor, so let's see what they can actually do here. They can actually get some... If they've been winning the aim duels a lot, this actually is an opportunity for Especially that smoke! Sporky That's and Jojo, they pop up out of the smoke, a nice and nasty drop. Mayhem is on the side, hiding in the smoke, they can't seem to find him, and Wimp just goes down there without a fight. Really, Mayhem gets a kill and an AK. Actually, 
Got some kills, serious man. damage down. Yeah, that's two kills for Mayhem. KRC is the last man standing. He's got nothing but a P250. But Airhead is pretty low effects. here. 17 HP on Airhead. They don't know where KRC is just yet. So everyone's watching a different angle, but no one's really watching. Under heaven, where are they? Leave Sporky. He's in a good spot. KRC is just hoping for an exit frag, really. Which is the best he can aim for at this point. Airhead needs to start running. He's down to 17 HP and they cannot afford to lose any weaponry at this stage of the game. But yeah, KRC makes it out alive with his trusty P25. Never mind. <laughs> Why? Why did he stand there? What was did that, KRC? Did, did I miss it? I looked he away just, for one second. He was, he was, he was gonna save his armor and P250, and he just jumped down towards the bomb to die. Yeah, and consider now he's he had to rebuy another half armor. What? And he has no P250. <laughs> so yeah, it's one of those uh, questionable whoopsie. decisions. That makes no sense. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> And uh, oh, come on, man, Jojo, you can make that flash. It's not this hard. This is the third time I've seen them fail that flash. I think it's not hard. <laughs> Just have it's to aim up. Both, yeah. oh, Mr. Nice, he's right outside a connector position. In short, has some backup in the form of kerosene, but that smoke effecti effectively blocked off the op from Vision. Their airhead, however, finds the entry onto Mr. Mayhem as they slowly make their way onto the B site. There is still. Mr. Nice on short, and I believe another player on heaven, that's KRC, with the op. The bomb plant is about to come through, or is it? Mr. Nice stops the bomb plant, getting the kill onto Mandy 2k. The bomb is now in an awkward position, and Wimp takes Ooh. advantage of it, so does Nasty. They're killing them one by one, it's only Patola and Airhead left here. Airhead already down to 21 HP, things are not looking good at all. Nasty finds that kill, it's only Airhead left. It's another kill for Nasty, it's a double for him. And Extreme 5 win the round 14 to 7, the scoreline. Two more rounds, and they qualify for the final. And they upgrade as well. They get two AKs out of that. They're still quite poor, but they have all the weaponry they need. Uh, KRC, the, the only person without much utility, because you had to drop in M4. Infamous though, they won a decent amount of rounds on that their, that little comeback they've had so far. That they can buy this round, but this is basically the only round they can buy. So, vital round for both teams. Especially for Infamous, who have not a lot of margin for error, while Extreme actually have more than enough rounds to buy again if they lose this. After that Nico yeah. does. Infamous, it's time to play some perfect CS question is, can they pull it off? This is not a good start at all. That's not Patola perfect, and though. Airhead dropping here for Infamous. They've got three people left to clutch this round. Make that two, because Wimp just found that kill onto Jojo, who was looking the other way. That flash onto Long also by some time. Manny 2k peaks. Sees an all, but he does not Ooh. check his right hand side. Yeah, that was that Mayhem be. behind the wall. Nasty from Toilets finds Sporky as well. Yeah. Extreme 5 wounded on. This is it. This is... This has to be it, really. 15 yeah, 7. Look at the money. No money yeah. whatsoever for Infamous. You said they had to play perfect CS, and they did the opposite. Yeah. They got clean sweeped instead, so now Extreme actually have money to buy if they lose this round. But are they going to lose this round? That's the question. They go 1.9, 1.2k, 2.1. So, this pistols and Mac 10s and an ump. Yeah, that's, it doesn't look very promising. But this B push, it's all or nothing. All or nothing on this one push. This is it, it for Infamous. They're betting all their eggs on this one basket. And it might just not work. Nasty just found that headshot onto Sporky. Wimp oh. keeps it going. Mandy 2k drops as well. It's all falling apart for Infamous. But Jojo, he's trying to bring it back. He gets that headshot onto Nasty. But Mr. Nice from short couldn't get anything with the AK. Airhead finds that kill. Patola what? gets two as well. What is happening? Infamous, they're actually doing this. They're actually doing this 3v5. KRC, he's got an op. He's in heaven. But he can't find that shot. And the bomb plant goes through. The molly's a bit too late. Jojo... 
He's actually Ooh, down to burn. 6 HP. He got double burn. He walks, burned. Back. He walks back into tick. it. That's interesting stuff. KRC, he's got a P250 with his op. He Does kills he risk it? Though. Does he go for the hero play? No. It seems like he's not going to go for it. Yeah, he's going to back off here. Or is he? He wants to peek. And he might just get a kill. Oh, the timing. The timing was just off as Patola is pushing up from stairs. Oh, oh no. He weapon switched at exactly the wrong time. And Patola will take that oh, one free died. kill. One died. And say thank you very much. He did not pick up the op, surprisingly enough. No, Patola. one died as well. So they lost more money than they actually have. Uh... On the other hand, Extreme, since I mentioned earlier, they did have enough money to buy regardless of losing. They will do that purchase, but Mr. Nice and Wimp actually... Actually, Wimp kinda did not buy. Okay, so Wimp had a lot less money than I thought he did. Uh, Mr. Nice, on the other hand, only has a fan mask. Let's see. Oh, KRC. He's blind. Sporky finds that kill on the KRC here and keeps it going. Look at that spray from Mayhem! Ooh. He gets three! Perfect for Mayhem! Airhead, Sporky, and Patola all drop to him. It's only Mandy and Jojo left here for Infamous. As they try to make their way towards that B site. Mayhem is still. Oh, ho, 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 wow! Oh, that was a good one, Deke. I don't even care that Wimp died there. That was a good, a really good one, Deke. Ah, uh, he'll be happy about that. But, Jojo is now in a 1v2 situation to keep his team's hopes alive here. Against Extreme 5. Mayhem and Nasty, they've got to work together to make this work. Jojo's at full HP, he's got head armor as well, so he's not gonna die to a simple dink from an M4. As he hides in water, he finds Mayhem looking the other way, he actually dinked him, he's on a 20 HP now. All he needs to do is land one shot and Nasty delivers. He wins it for Extreme 5 here, 16 to 8, the final scoreline. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Extreme 5 win the semi final here. Deemed esteemed guests. Yeah, dear esteemed guests. 2 0 victory for Extreme 5. They played well, you have to admit.